Ladies and gentlemen, please rise for the presentation of colors. The United States and Canadian National Anthems, sung by the voices of IFD. the whole 
Please remain standing for the invocation by Father John McCaslin. Let us pray. In the Gospel of Luke, Jesus told a parable. A man wished to justify himself, so he said to Jesus, And who is my neighbor? Jesus replied, A man fell victim to robbers as he went down from Jerusalem to Jericho. They stripped and beat him and went off, leaving him half dead. A priest happened to be going down that road, but when he saw him, he passed by on the opposite side. Likewise, a Levite came to the place, and when he saw him, he passed by on the opposite side. But a Samaritan traveler who came upon him was moved with compassion at the sight. He approached the victim, poured oil and wine over his wounds, and bandaged them. Then he lifted him up on his, his own animal, took him to an inn, and cared for him. The next day, he took out two silver coins and gave them to the innkeeper with the instruction, Take care of him. If you spend more than what I have given you, I shall repay you on my way back. Which of these three, in your opinion, was neighbor to the victim? He answered, the one who treated him with mercy. Jesus said to him, go and do likewise. Gracious God, as we gather over these days from near and far, we do so as members of this incredible fraternal vocation of firefighting. We gather as those who have responded to the call of our communities to help those in need and in distress. We gather as healers. We gather as rescuers. We gather as those who enter into danger in order to save people from harm. We gather as teachers. And we gather as neighbors. Loving God, we pray that you send your spirit upon those gathered here, as well as our peers who remain at home. Bless us with a spirit of fellowship. Bless us with an openness to learn about the newest information, the newest techniques, the newest equipment, the best practices. Fill us with gratitude for the opportunity to serve as firefighters. Bless all those who support firefighters through research, through supplying the resources necessary, and in various ways back in our communities. Bless and strengthen the families of firefighters, that our families and homes may be a place of peace and strength. Bless those in positions of leadership and authority with the gift of wisdom. Bless those who remain on duty this day and in every day, and those who respond to emergencies, from the first one in to the last one out, we pray you keep them safe. And finally, Lord, we ask that during these days, you fill all who are here with a renewed spirit that can be taken home and spread like fire to their colleagues. We ask this through Christ our Lord. Amen. Color guard, us sing. 